part number two, part two. So, where am I coming from? Where, where, where am I going? Where am I coming from from this question, first of all? To this question, this week's question, is when it comes to being a leader, a team leader, and they're building that team, are they a manager first, and then they work up to being a, a, team, a team leader? So, where am I coming from with this question? There's many avenues of thought, there's many ways of thinking about it, but ultimately, is it just that because people get hired on board and said, well, there's your leader, you automatically accept that? Or is it that when a leader's putting together a team, say in the NFL, a new head coach comes in, he's putting together a team. Now he's obviously worked with these people, so obviously he's established a rapport, he's established a, a relationship with them where they understand and look to him as the leader. But what if you're coming in cold? What if you're coming in cold and there's no confidence there, there's nothing established, and I'm not saying that just because they're appointed the leader there should be no confidence, no. There's no relationship, there's no foundation, there's nothing to work from there. So what's the answer? And that's where I'm coming from with this. That's why I'm asking you, what do you think? What is your answer to this week's question? When it comes to team building, do you believe a team leader is a team manager first and then works his or her way up to leader, to getting that title of leader? That's my question. So have a great day. I'll talk to you tomorrow.